The excitement was wearing off and the pressure of following Jesus. The difficulty of being different was starting to press in a little bit. So as everybody else starts leaving, Jesus turns to the 12 apostles and he says, do you want to go away as well? And here's what I believe Peter was thinking. If you give me a little bit of leeway here. I think Peter was saying this. We don't understand what it means to eat your flesh and drink your blood either. We don't know how to answer the questions that people keep asking us about you. We aren't always comfortable with what you see we see you doing and what you ask us to do. This isn't always what we thought it would be when we signed up. But to whom should we go? Right, right. You have the words of eternal life, and we have believed and have come to know that you are the Holy One of God. I believe Peter was saying, if you are who you say you are, if you are who we believe you are, then we belong to you. And belonging is not simply this feel-good thing that I found a place where I belong. Belonging means he controls me, he keeps me, he is my shepherd and I am his sheep. I yield to him, I submit to him, I surrender to him. His way is now my way. I don't have a way anymore because I belong. To him. The Apostle Paul wrote in 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse 12, as he was preparing himself for death and comforting his spiritual son over, over the fact that he was going to die, he says this to Timothy, I know in whom I have believed, and I am convinced that he is able to guard until that day what has been entrusted to me. Guys, have we believed like that? Have we believed to the point of being convinced? Have we believed to the point where when we don't understand, we can stand on what we know? That when we don't like what's going on, we can stand on what we know? That we are devoted to what He has said, to who He is, to what the Scriptures say about Him? That we can say, I don't have all the answers, but I am confident of His character. I am sure of who He is. I belong to Him. Hear Peter again. To whom shall we go? Peter doesn't say, we get it. Peter doesn't say, I understand. Peter doesn't even say, I agree. Peter says, where are we going? Where else are we going? Where? Because everybody else is just going home. Peter made a decision, I'm not going home again. I may not know where I'm going, but I'm not going home again. I'm not going back to my plans, my dreams.